Wet insulation is a bigger problem in ammonia refrigeration piping than many people realize. It leads to corrosion, which means trouble. Sometimes you can see it, most times you can't. GGS finds wet insulation with non-destructive testing. Most of the piping and trouble spots in an ammonia system are concealed, so we approach each and every testing location the same, with no assumptions. First, we record everything we see and smell that will support our evaluation. Then we scan the pipe. The NDT method we use, radiometric profiling, measures piping in the system as is, so we don't have to cut holes in the insulation. And it does not pose a radiation safety risk, so facility staff can be present during testing. The results are revealed in real time. The graph clearly indicates there is a presence of wet insulation. The small leading rise we see before the spike indicates a density greater than the insulation, but not as dense as the pipe material. Sometimes there are visual indications that the insulation is wet, like where there is damage to the jacketing or the pipe is dripping. But more often than not, the profiler finds wet insulation on piping that looks like it's in great shape. In fact, we have found this in 100% of the facilities we have tested. On average, 30% of the piping in an ammonia refrigeration system has wet insulation. To identify how much insulation is affected, we scan additional locations along the pipe. GGS reporting identifies where wet insulation exists and the extent of the damage. Our process is thorough and our data is conclusive. You will be able to make informed decisions on how to address threats you can see and those you can't, like wet insulation in your piping system. So when you need to test, Choose GGS.